là on va aller voir Lorraine. Mom? Mom! But are you happy? Happiness is overrated, Lorraine. I'm content. Well, I'll think about it. Mom? Hi there, Martin. I saw you as I was driving in. Did you hear me honking? Mom, that can't be you. Martin, are you alright? I'm, I'm, I'm fine. It's just that you're so, so gray. Well, isn't that an uplifting way to greet your mother? Sorry, I just don't... I guess you're right, though. I am going a little gray. No thanks to your father. Qu'est-ce que tu fais là? So what? Are you out here shopping or something? Oh, shopping? Puff. Who shops anymore? No, it's that time of the month for me again. Uh. For my civic duty, I'll be polishing the statue all day. Oh, right. À qui est cette golfette? What's with the golf cart, Mom? Now, Martin, I know you're embarrassed to be driving around in last year's model, but we really can't afford the 86s yet. What about my truck? No one owns a truck in Hill Valley. Martin, are you sure you're feeling okay? Yeah, yeah, I just... I must have had a really vivid dream last night. Well, I hope your dream world was more fun than this one. Could you do me a favor? I forgot to give your father my timesheet for last week, and now Mr. Nosy is convinced that I'm hiding something from him. Timesheet? Aren't they annoying? But Citizen Brown always says, a scheduled life is a happy life. Anywho, could you be a dear and drop it off at the house? Here, take the car. Actually, I... I know, uh... I know, dear. Love you too. I'd give you a kiss, but you know what that gets you. Don't forget to pick me up this evening. Uh, yeah, sure. Et voilà. Bon, allez. On va aller faire ça tout de suite. Encore une fois, pour ne pas well, perdre de temps. The truck, but I guess it'll do. Alors ici, quand il parle de truck, en fait, c'est... Euh, enfin, il traduit ça par camionnette. Alors que, en réalité, c'est le 4x4 qu'on voit euh, à la fin du film. Du premier film. a peeping Tom. Ah! Dad, try to warn your old man the next time, okay? Hey, Demary. Hey, what for? <laughs> Insufficiently polished shoes. Good day, citizen. Um, I saw Mom downtown. She told me to give this to you. Thanks. Say, uh, what gives around here? Ah, uh, you know, the usual. Keeping tabs on Hill Valley through my trusty bank of monitors. Always on the lookout for some interesting footage. Why do you do that? You're spying on people? <clears throat> Why? What kind of silly question is that? I've been gathering candid documentary footage for Citizen Brown's promotional videos for over a year now. I know your mother doesn't approve of my work, but... Wait a minute. You say you saw Lorraine? 11 to 12 hair salon, 12 to 12 20 lunch at soup mo counter, cream of asparagus with crackers... What was that? You know your mother's problems. If she slips up again, it could mean demerits for the whole family. There she is, polishing the statue in the park. Just like the schedule dictates. Oh, then everything's fine. Good. Unless... How was she when you spoke to her? Lucid? Sober? Maman est une alcoolo? Whoa, Dad, what are you telling me? Are you saying Mom's a drunk? Shh, I don't know for sure that your mother is relapsed into her old ways, but she's been acting very odd lately, almost as if she didn't like my constant supervision. Confidentially, I suspect she's got a flask hidden somewhere, probably very near the spot where she's working right now. Do me a favor, son, will you? See if you can worm the truth out of her. She won't confide in me, but she may be less guarded with you. Double rations this week if you help your old man out, what do you say? That's a good boy. Okay, Dad, we need to talk. Um...
Qu'est-ce que tu cachais quand je suis arrivé parce que c'est important. Hiding when I came in just now. Hiding? I don't know what you're talking about, son. Come on, I saw it. It was a videotape, right? Um, I might as well tell you. After all, you'll be 18 soon. Tell me what? Hill Valley under Citizen Brown is not quite the contented town you were led to believe it was. J'y crois pas. I don't believe it. This isn't a criticism of the great man himself, of course, or his sainted wife, Edna. No one's worked harder than they to apply the most advanced social planning techniques to our municipality, but... What? Confidentially, not everybody appreciates it. A great many citizens, perhaps even the majority, actively resent the Brown administration. They don't say so publicly, of course. But in private? Well, just listen. I tell you, Bert, this regime is a joke. They're all laughing at us over in Fairfax. A toast to Citizen Brown. May his beloved courthouse be struck by lightning. Shh, Agnes, you're awful. Are you coming to the town square, Lester? Citizen Brown's about to give another speech. Citizen Brown can kiss my hairy... Well, you get the idea. It sounds like people can't stand what the Browns have done to Hill Valley. Not everyone. Only around 50%, maybe 60. Does Citizen Brown know? He should. Whenever I send copies of my raw footage to the public relations department over at the courthouse, I get a memo telling me how much Citizen Brown thanks me for my service. But how could he see those videos and not do anything about it? Maybe you should take your tapes directly to Brown. Oh, I don't know about that. I mean, sure, he might appreciate my bringing these problems to his attention and reward me for my public service, but then again, they say it's never wise to be the bearer of bad news. Je vais apporter la cassette au citoyen Brown. Why don't you give me those videotapes? I'll take them to Citizen Brown. Thanks for offering, son, but I don't want to get you involved. Citizen Brown won't like what he sees on them, and I wouldn't want you to get the brunt of his displeasure. Not to mention the displeasure of all the folks on the tapes. Once they find out I recorded them... No, I'm not letting these tapes out of my sight. It's too dangerous. Bon, euh, y a pas grand chose à... Bon, les parents, on va pas trop s'y intéresser, on va s'intéresser à Marty. It's about me. I'm all ears. Je suis comment Well, uh, from certain things I've heard, I get the idea that people in this town regard Marty McFly as a... As a what A nerd. They said that In so many words. Just because a boy studies hard and gets straight A's and respects the rules and doesn't party or drink or stay out late and is perhaps a bit socially inept and obsessed with personal hygiene and prefers his rubber band collection Stop. to... I really don't want to hear anymore. I'm proud of you, son. Moi, Jennifer. I'm trying to understand why Jennifer broke up with me in this time. Uh, recent past. Are you still mooning over that girl? Forget her! She's bad news! Why, my surveillance cameras have caught her doing things that, that are completely against the Hill Valley Code. I don't want to know. Kissing boys. Sitting with boys in cars. I've kept quiet about it for her father's sake, but believe me, you're well rid of her. Où est-ce que... Où est-ce que je peux me trouver? You, uh... Is there anywhere you expect me to be, like, right now? Well, I did expect you to be up at the lake until tomorrow with that math and magic competition, so I guess your time is pretty much your own right now. Okay, different subject. Yeah? Ouais, bon, il n'y a pas grand chose d'autre à savoir, il me semble. Euh, il y a... Attends. Demander à propos de... Quelqu'un qu'on connaît tous les It's deux, c'est ça C'est sur quelqu'un que nous connaissons tous, oui Donc Edna, on a vu tout à l'heure que c'était effectivement devenu la femme de Doc. Qu'est-ce que vous pouvez me dire sur Edna Mrs. Citizen Brown Oh, elle est une femme formidable. Les gens pensent juste à elle comme cette sweet, self-effacing, grandmotherly type. Edna Nous parlons de la même chose Vraiment, elle est juste aussi impliquée dans running the town que son mari est. Parlez-moi du citoyen. Parle-moi du citoyen Brown. Have you ever spent time with Citizen Brown? Well, of course I'm in the audience for every one of his public addresses. One on one, I mean. Oh, no. He'd never notice a common sector L citizen like me. 
but I dream that someday he'll recognize me for my public service and maybe let me shake his hand. Voilà. Hmm. Something on your mind? Je pense que pour le moment, ce sera tout. Well, I'll leave you to your snooping. Supervising, son. Supervising. I'll leave you to it. Right. <laughs> La guitare. Hey, what's très my guitar utile. doing out here? Your mother and I convinced you to give it up, remember? Rock and roll music is frowned on by the Brown administration. It sets a poor example for all the kids who look up to you as a model of studiousness and moral gravity. And besides, you're not very good. Donne-moi la guitare. Come on, Dad. I need that guitar. Give me one good reason why I should give it back to you. Because... Euh, le rock c'est mon destin. Rock and roll is my density. Um, destiny. <rire> destiny. What would you know about destiny? Now quit fooling around and get back to your studies. J'en ai besoin pour impressionner Jennifer. A certain girl is only gonna like me if I can play the guitar. A certain girl? You don't mean Jennifer? Oh, Martin. Why are you fixated on that little Helly and she's nothing but trouble? Yeah. My kind of trouble. And besides, the way you play guitar, you're only gonna drive her further up. Go ahead, son. Do your worst. Thanks, Dad. <laughs> Il a repensé euh, au conseil de, bah, au conseil de Marty lui-même en fait, hein, parce que Marty a donné des conseils à son père dans le passé en 1955, et c'est pour ça qu'il a accepté finalement. Euh, euh, que son fils reprenne la guitare. <rire> enfin, moi, pour moi, c'est une référence à ça. Par contre, une petite question qu'on se pose, c'est euh, par rapport à... Euh, par rapport à... Marty, qui est censé être euh, à une compétition mathématique. Donc il y a une théorie comme quoi il serait à deux endroits à la fois. Mais est-ce que c'est vraiment le cas Est-ce qu'on doit considérer que Marty est à deux endroits à la fois ou est-ce qu'on doit considérer que euh, l'ancien Marty a complètement disparu de la réalité pour, euh, rem pour être remplacé par celui-là C'est pas facile de savoir. C'est comme quand, euh, quand euh, Biff contrôle la ville dans le deuxième film. Euh, est-ce qu'il y a un deuxième Marty en Suisse Ou est-ce que le Marty qui est en Suisse disparaît Voilà, c'est des choses qu'on ne sait pas trop finalement. Euh, pas évident de savoir comme ça donc là ce que je vais faire pour pas perdre de temps having fun kid that who said that attempting to destroy public landmarks is a violation of c64 i wasn't trying to destroy it take your demerit <laughs> Euh, si je recommence, normalement ça devrait être bon. C'est la première fois, on se prend un avertissement, mais je pense que normalement après il n'y a pas de souci. Ah J'ai rien dit, j'ai rien dit. Je pense qu'il faut que je, par... que je parle à Lorraine d'abord. Excusez-moi, j'ai un peu de mal à m'exprimer ce soir. La fatigue joue beaucoup. Je vous remercie d'avoir regardé cette vidéo et à bientôt pour la suite du walkthrough de Retour vers le futur.